WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in Clearwater, Florida, 2 p.m. Eastern time, two hours left to go in the trading day. And markets pretty much at session highs. We get the S&P up 10 points, trading 2831. Dow Jones negative by just 19 points now, trading at 25,222. And the NASDAQ positive by 48, trading at 7889. Start things off, let's jump over to that Nadex platform, check in on some of the futures markets. We'll start it off with the Dow 30 trading just over 25,200, 25,201. As you can see, session highs for the entire trading day. NASDAQ 100, quite an acceleration throughout the day. Round down here, like 8 a.m., we'll call it. We're trading at 7,408. We're almost a solid 65 NASDAQ 100 points above that level, trading 74.73. S&P's also climbing higher early in the session, pre-market trading 28.15. We're now trading 15 points above that level, 28.30 in the S&P's. Gold contract volatility in both directions, trading lower for most of the morning from 12.33 down to 12.28. We're now almost right back up to that 12.33 price range, 12.32.55. Bitcoin continuing to struggle a bit. Quite a good couple weeks for Bitcoin, trading from 6,200 all the way up to 8,400 and change overnight. From there, off a couple hundred dollars, trading 81.20. And talk about volatility. Crude oil, EIA numbers at 10.30. We get a draw of 6 million barrels. Estimate was a draw of 3 million barrels. You see oil spike higher trade lower and then back higher we go reaching highs of about 69.68 right about noon or about 38 pennies off that level trading 69.30 in the price of crude so big day for earnings we get facebook after the bell let's check on facebook and before we do this is boeing so that was one of the biggest factors this morning in the Dow, you still have Boeing down about 2.5% today off $9. And to jump around, Facebook, whoops, we'll get it, FB. Facebook coming into that number, NASDAQ having quite a day, Facebook contributing to that run. Facebook up 1.2% as we await their numbers after the bell and to take a look at what we'll be looking for. These are the numbers and they are big numbers. Of course, monthly active users, 2.25. Daily, 1.49 billion, it's quite a number when you look at monthly and daily people logging on to Facebook and uh, Facebook, of course, Instagram, the whole deal. Revenue, 13.36 billion and earnings of a buck 72. So we'll see right after that closing bell. Stay tuned, Steve Rhodes, excuse me, David White coming up right now with the Power Trading Hour. Have a great Wednesday, everybody.